Okay, so I'm gonna go and start doing something a little bit different uh, for these reviews from now on. I'm gonna try and review as many episodes of The Loud House, Casa Grandes, whatever show it may be. I'm gonna try and review as many episodes as possible. Rather it be something that I don't really have much to say about, or something that I have a lot of things to say about. I don't know, I really want to keep on doing these um, top reviews and doing a lot more of them because I love doing these and um, there's a lot of episodes I really want to get to, but I just can't. So I'm going to start off with Hurl Interrupted. This is a, one of the more recent episodes that came out, I believe, a week ago as I'm recording this video. This episode focuses on Lynn afraid of throwing up on a roller coaster at Dairyland and basically just stalling her friends from getting on the ride because she doesn't want to admit that she's afraid of throwing up and stuff like that. Yes, it's kind of cliche in terms of the plot, it really, really is, but it wasn't bad or anything, so I'll give it a pass, as I always tend to do with cliches, as you guys know, I don't really, not really too, like, worried about cliches, I'm not really too worried about them, unlike my everything wrong, that's where I sin every single time there is one, so I'll give it a pass because it's decent with the way they did it. In fact, actually, the short and, like, TV network synopsis I actually saw whenever the episode was first being, I guess, revealed, it sounded a lot like Roller Cowards from um, season, oddly enough, season 5 of Spongebob, which um, I thought was very interesting. It was just like, kind of basically saying how it seemed like she was just afraid of the roller coaster. Not afraid of throwing up, just afraid of the roller coaster. Which really wouldn't have made any sense, so I'm glad it was that way because, I mean, Lynn is not really someone who would be afraid of heights or anything. Her being afraid of throwing up is a lot more like, okay, that makes sense. That, that makes a lot more sense to me. But I do like Lynn a lot in this episode, uh, as I normally do with these uh, Lynn-centric episodes. Uh, she has a few funny moments. Uh, there's a lot of funny moments in this episode, actually. I guess the episode kind of had a little bit of a climax as well, the bull and Lynn. It was kind of interesting and kind of uh, fun how they kind of did that and stuff. And definitely wasn't something I was expecting to happen in this episode, but it happened. It was kind of cool, regardless. But yeah, this episode was good. I mean, what more can you really say about it? It's definitely way better than the sister episode, Diamonds Are Forever, which I am going to be looking at, which is a sister episode to this one that came out like a week or two ago. So stay tuned, I'll look at that one probably either tomorrow as you're watching this or the next day, but depending on however I upload these, it's going to be weird trying to upload these uh, top reviews from now on because of how many I'm probably going to be pushing out now. But guys, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and awesome. And of course, guys, I'll see you guys next day. Thank you guys so much for watching, and goodbye, everybody. I'll see you guys soon. Take care, everyone.